Visiting with Dr. Brian Prax of Chronic Care Charlottesville, supporter of the Senior Center News and Events on Seville 1075 and 1260 WCHV. Uh, you mentioned a word coming in here, and it sounds one of those big, scary medical words, cortisol. Right. Uh, what, what is that, and, and why is it something that we need to be uh, thinking about carefully, as we, especially as we age? Yeah. Cortisol is one of those, one of those hormones that, that is released by the brain in response to stress. And what I, what I was telling you about is that how chronic pain releases cortisol, and if it's released on a chronic, almost never-ending, long-standing um, uh, situation, then mm -hmm. that actually can kill nerves, not only the brain, the peripheral nerves, the nerves in your hands and feet. It, it does some serious, serious damage. Now, so, it, yeah. that's sort of the uh, old school, oh, I just tough it out. I, it's not that bad. And, you know, and, and if it's even just a dull ache in a hip or something like that, uh, you should have that checked out then. It should definitely be checked out. If you just bump your knee and you have a little you know, pain that lasts for a little while and then it gets better, not a problem. It's chronic, long-standing pain keeps releasing this cortisol. And some of the things, some of the ways you'll know if you're, if you're having too much cortisol or too much stress is one, you're not sleeping well. Um, not, even when you do sleep, you still feel tired. Weight gain, especially around your abdomen. Uh, craving unhealthy foods, which is interesting because cortisol raises your blood sugar, putting you at risk for diabetes, which is a problem that can lead to neuropathy and a whole bunch of other things too. So you want to get that cortisol under control. You don't have to be James Burke to do connections on this. We see how it all sorts of swirls around uh, in that. So chronic pain leads to this high cortisol level and then, then that starts to lead to all the things that lead to peripheral neuropathy. And other, and other conditions, obesity, diabetes, yeah, all connected. Well, go in and see Dr. Prax about this. Call him or find him online at chroniccarecharlottesville.com. Thanks, Dr. Prax. All right, thank you, Joe.